my fourth Arduino project. And, uh, in my car, there is a uh, clock. Uh, it's a digital clock, actually. The digital clock. I want to make the same clock. And for that, I made this. And I. For uh, two, uh, for two displays is for a minute and uh, other uh, it's for uh, hours. And this uh, dot is indicating the seconds. In my previous project, I explained to keep the sand for frozen. Then we keep two displays like that. And when we keep the sand for four seven, uh, we we can control the display. Uh, in four bits, but now it's uh, four uh, displays. I cannot uh, keep uh, four and four four seven. I have to keep the, because it's uh, four to four sixteen. The Arduino has only thirteen ports. The Arduino cannot handle it. Thanks to my father, he introduced me persistence of vision. Persistence of vision means. When we do something very quickly, we feel like it's doing continuously. And like that, in my clock, I do like that. Now I will explain about my clock. Now you will feel like all the displays are on at the time, but it's not. But like one display is on it, on and it will off. Second display will on and it uh, comes off. So third display will on. Like that is going. But when we do that uh, quickly, we feel like it's uh, doing continuously. That is persistence of motion. Uh, for uh, make you understand, I slow down the display. Now I am displaying the display uh, in one second. In my program, it's just uh, ten milliseconds, and you will feel like all the displays are on in one second. Now it's uh, like one display is on, give the corresponding number, and uh, make the display off. Second display is on, like that is going. In my uh, original program, uh, the, all the displays will. Uh, the delay will be uh, 10 milliseconds and we will feel like all the displays are on and now I will explain the circuit and uh, now I keep the sand for frozen the sand for frozen input I connected to the Arduino and uh, uh, the output of sand for frozen I connected to all the displays all the four displays and the displays power the positive power possibly I connected to the Arduino from the Arduino I can uh, control the display on and off and if I on this display and give the corresponding number that for that display will blink that number then I uh, on the second display I lower the display from here and I on the second display and give the corresponding number like that I am loop I have 10 millisecond delay in the loop and there is a variable called W it will uh, increment on uh, when the loop is uh, coming uh, when the loop loop is uh, the variable will increment and when it is equal to 6000 means 1 minute uh, I will increment the, the minute to variable and when minute 2 equal to uh, 10, I'll uh, the minute 2 equal to 0, I'll keep the minute 2 equal to 0 and the minute 1 variable I will add 1 to it and again I'll, I has a if and that is equal to like, uh, when, uh, when uh, minute 2 equal to uh, uh, if uh, if uh, minute uh, two equal to ten, uh, minute two equal to zero, and uh, I, in the minute one, I will add uh, one to it, 
and there is a if uh, the if like uh, minute one if minute one equal to six and sixty uh, uh, I will uh, our two will increment our two will increment and minute one I will uh, change it to zero and the second uh, third if is uh, when our two equal to ten uh, our one equal our one equal to uh, our one equal to our one plus one and uh, the our two will uh, I'll set the our two into zero and this uh, the fourth if is uh, when our uh, one equal to two and uh, our uh, two equal to four means twenty four uh, twenty four hours it will uh, change in the, the all variable will uh, change in zero and the down it will display it. all the variable it will display this is how this i will display the numbers into the display first i will uh, switch on the uh, f first display and uh, depending on the variable i will display uh, I, depending on the variable i will display this uh, so the, this uh, binary numbers to serve and for four sevens uh, for four bits and i will keep a delay and the, uh, i will switch off the uh, display and the second display like that i have four displays for four displays i get four variables like that i will uh, do the displays I'll bring the display so one, one by one, one by one like that. This is how my clock works and I hope uh, 